A pleasure to me all at last, and H-Chan proudly presents to you another peace of mind. Simply put, for number 1967, we're going to be focusing on another terminology known as regulation. And there are plenty of ways to iterate it here. Regulation does specifically refer to the act or doing of putting in legal requirements. And they are in fact relative to law, as the term is very synonymous with other terms like law and rule, or order, as it can be used in distinct ways, similar to how laws are put in by Congress or otherwise. For one good example, regulations were put in by railroad authorities after the 1918 Hagenbach Wallace Circus train crashed into an army troop train in Gary, Indiana. So of course, just to give you a good perspective on that, regulations are indeed a part of law. Legal requirements that technically put up a mandate to certain people with certain jobs. Like for example, if someone wants to operate machinery for long periods of time, then there are requirements to prevent any possible accidents or damage. Because it would be nasty to potentially fall asleep at the controls. But a number of things are also in there. Not just from the mandated hour working in terms of the schedule, but there's a number of other things as well. Safety controls, programming, and all sorts of things can be put into today's modern machinery and computing systems just to ensure that the operator does not allow himself to fall asleep, which can be devastating to them or also to others. Also anyone else who could be caught near a potential blast or other sorts of damage radius. It would not be a great story to hear, or talk about, at some point. But nonetheless, with all the new things in play, all the disasters that have unfolded throughout history, and all the things that have occurred, many people died then, so today, we may live longer. It's not just with trains, not just with other machines, but also with the foods we eat, the activities we plan, the routines we set upon, the schedules that we live by on our daily lives, they're all there for us when we need them the most. And so, that's why we're here today. If you're watching this episode, just know the many years that have come and gone, the many accidents that may have happened in your life, and the many advances based on regulation. If it wasn't for certain things that had happened, then we would definitely not realize the consequences of certain actions that would take place. And so, there we go. Another one down, plenty more to go. Until next time on HJN.